Okay, this morning, guys, we're going to be shooting the Hordendy 9x18 Makarov round. It's a 95 grain XTP round. It's from their XTP line, obviously. Very good bullet. As you guys can see there, that's pretty deep hollow point for a 95 grain round. Now, this is going to be shot out of a two and a half, three inch barrel CZ82, and we're going to be shooting this through four layers of denim and the calibrated gel. Uh, product number for this is 91002 comes from their custom line. You can pick this up pretty much anywhere that sells Hordendy rounds. Um, I bought mine online. So uh, I, I did see this at a couple of the big box places, but it was a lot cheaper buying it online. They do advertise muzzle velocity at 1,000 feet per second. So let's get this shot and find out okay, how it guys, works. Here we go with the Hordendy 95 grain XTP 9mm Makarov round. Let's get it shot through the gel and find out how it works. That raised it up some. Let's go check it out. Okay, guys, I went ahead and cut open that wound track for that 9mm Makarov XTP round. You can see right there, it went in, looks like right about the inch mark. Rapid expansion, lost a lot of denim. You can see the cuts down through there. This is the right side of the track. Looks like it did a little upward. Look at this little arc movement here. And then settled back down again. A little weird for a shot to come in. It'll have a little arc to it. And then it came on down, came on down. Right now we're at 11, 12, 12 and 3 quarters where I dug it up out of this second block of gel here. And it looks like very good uniform expansion. Went back. Looks like pedals are back to the core. Once again, the Horton D. 9x18 Makarov 95 grain XTP round. I'll get weights and measurements in post. You guys have a good one. Okay guys, another little look at here. Uh, we are at the post of the Horton D. 9x18 Makarov round. It's a 95 grain XTP loaded round. It does come from Horton D, obviously. And it does come from their custom shop. This round was rated at 1,000 feet per second. And we shot it through four layers of denim and the calibrated gel, as you guys seen in the video, if you watched the whole video. Now, penetration and everything, we got 12 and 3 quarter pretty damn good out of a small round like this now weight retention measurements everything like that I'll throw up in there so you guys can see it was a very good round I did shoot this today out of my CZ82 check police pistol and it performed very well this gun performs very well every time I shoot it um, you guys seen the other tests I did the other day this is a different kind of round. It's a heavier round, 95 grain. It's the XTP round. The XTP round's a very good round. I've done a lot of reloading with this kind of a round, and I've shot a lot of these loads that have been made by Hordendy themselves. They make a great round. Now, once again, weight retention, 94.9. Awesome. Look at the peel back of that. Just perfect. It did a great job. Now, this thing measured out, I'll throw right there for you too, 0.565. This is a mediocre 9mm round in most people's eyes. Not very mediocre anymore. 5.65, penetration 12 and 3 quarter out of a blowback style pistol. That's doing pretty well. And out of a pistol that holds 12 rounds in the magazine. Nothing to shake a stick at. Once again, guys, the Hordendy Custom 9x18 Makarov 95 grain XTP round. Once again, it was rated at 1,000 feet per second. I did not rate this. I did not shoot this on a chronograph, so I don't know exactly what it comes out of this pistol. But I do know out of this pistol, I'm getting 12 and 3 quarter penetration, 94.9 weight retention, and I'm getting .565 expansion. Can't ask for much better out of a small tuck away gun. Or, in this case, you could use this as a primary gun. You guys have a good one.